Welcome back to WB Mason Presents the Joe Girardi Show. Don't forget, if you have a question for Joe, you can reach him by emailing him, askjoe at yesnetwork.com, or visit the Yes Network Facebook page and drop him a line there. You can always send him a tweet at Joe Girardi Show. Joe, I think you're going to like these this week. Okay. And we'll start off with Ride Through It via Twitter. Can you sing? Everybody can sing. It's just a matter can of someone well? wants. <laughs> it's just a matter of someone wants to listen to you. And in, in my case, people don't really want to listen. No. No. Not even a, a little snippet of "Take Me Out to the Ball Game." Well, I, I think everyone can sing that, but again, it may not be pleasing to the ears. <laughs> All right, we'll move on. Real Vinny Brown via Twitter writes. When will we get to see Murphy again, or will he stay down in Scranton all year? Oh, I, I think we'll see him again at some point. Um, he's playing very well down in Scranton, and that's what we wanted, and we wanted to continue his development. But, um, you know, right now we're set with our, our two catchers, but I think we'll see him again. Any word on how he's doing down in he's Scranton? He's doing pretty good. I mean, he's been swinging the bat. He's been catching well, so he's been playing a lot. A lot of times guys can kind of hang their head a little bit when they're sent down, but it doesn't seem like he'd be the type of guy to do that. No, I mean, he's very businesslike, and, and I've had that discussion with a lot of the young players that got sent down. Don't do what I did. <laughs> Don't go down and pout for two weeks um, and waste two weeks because you never know when that phone might ring. And you look at Francisco Cervelli, a guy that has kind of been plagued by injuries. Uh, he's come up and he's contributed. Not a yes. ton of that bats, but it seems like he's really making the most of his Yeah, he's swinging the bat well and he's done a really good job um, behind home plate. And, and as we saw he threw out an important base runner in Minnesota on Friday afternoon and um, he's played well. All right, G. Monfies via Twitter. Joe, why don't you have your daughter with you in your home press conferences all the time? She's funny. <laughs> <laughs> Which one? Um, believe me, they like going up there, but, you know, sometimes the, it, sometimes I feel it's not appropriate. But they enjoy being in the press conferences. And, uh, you know, they're, they're such a huge part of my life, and they're such a huge part of this baseball life that I want them to feel like they're a part of it. And do you think they, they probably don't know any other way? You no, the they don't. I mean, for the most part, that's all they've ever known. Last one, Verdi from Manhattan writes us via email. Joe, what advice would you give a young second baseman who has the yips? Who has the yips? Continue don't, to play don't catch. Don't get the yips? <laughs> yeah, well, no. I mean, you have to relax, and you have to believe in yourself, and you have to make sure that your mechanics are proper. It, you know, a lot of times the yips can start by not throwing properly, whether you're throwing off your back foot or you're not getting your arm in the slot that it needs to be. You need to find that consistency, and I always think people should practice in the mirror so they can see the consistency. When you have a feel of what it feels like to throw it right, then practice in the mirror. And I know for me, I used to practice so much, I would try to throw to second base with my eyes closed because throwing is just, it's just a habit. It's a repetition, and you just got to do it a lot until you get it right. Did you ever go through a point in your career, whether it be when you were in T-ball or mm -hmm. all the way up to the majors where you kind of struggled with something like No, that? I, I really never did. I never had the yips, and I've always had that confidence that I could throw the baseball uh, where I want, and it's something tough to go through, but... Keep practicing, you'll get through it. 